Welcome back to my channel. Today I will explain how to enable the administrator user account and change its password in Windows, as it is disabled by default. Through this method, you can change any user's password even if you don't remember their old password. Let's get started without wasting any time. Welcome to my channel, Technicio. There are two methods to do this. The first method is through computer management, and the second is through command prompt. For the first method, using computer management, you can open it in two ways. First, right-click on the This PC icon. On Windows 11, click the Show More Options tab after right-clicking, then select Manage. On Windows 10, the Manage option appears directly after right-clicking. The second way is to press the Windows key plus R on your keyboard to open the Run dialog box. Type compmgmt.msc and press Enter. This will open Computer Management. Inside Computer Management, go to Local Users and Groups on the left side, then click the Users folder. Here you will find the Administrator account. Double-click on it and in the Properties window, uncheck the box labeled Account is Disabled because this account is disabled by default. Click Apply, then OK. Now, right-click on the administrator user again and select Set Password. Since this is the first time setting a password, you will be prompted to enter a new password. Type your desired password, confirm it, and click OK. The administrator account is now enabled with your new password. For the second method, using Command Prompt, you need to open Command Prompt as an administrator. Press Windows key plus R, type CMD, then press Control plus Shift plus Enter to run it with administrator rights. Once opened, type the command net user administrator slash active colon yes. And press Enter. This will enable the administrator account. Next, press the upward arrow key to reuse the previous command, then edit it to net user administrator asterisk, and press enter. You will be asked to type a new password, which will become the administrator account's password. Note that this method only works if you already have access to your system. If you've forgotten your system password, this method won't help. For password recovery methods, stay tuned for my next video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon so you don't miss any future tutorials. If you have questions, leave them in the comments below. Together, let's end tech frustrations. Thank you for watching.